in mind, at first it was just a title. Mm -hmm. You know, like the name of the album should be Who Is Terrence Mark at okay. the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? But it's just a title. So we we all went in, me, Punch, Camille, a, a, all of like the whole squad went in and pretty much just said, yo, let's let's really let's let's tell my story. Like let let's paint the picture how it should be painted. You, you, you feel what I'm saying? We're, we're like on Lock High One. It was like I was in the. I mean, shit. I had like eight hundred thousand dollars in the bank on Lock High One. I wasn't thinking about anything being cohesive right, right. at all. It was just fuck it. Fuck what everybody thinks. I feel like I'm rich. I wasn't, but you know what I'm saying. So it sounds like it's scattered, and it, that's where my brain was on Lock High One. On this, it's focused because I don't have that much money in the bank no more. <laughs> and do you feel like that that creates a, a better vibe for music? Hell no. Nah. <laughs> Why is that? It's Don't like, ever believe that but shit. But no, but it seems like a lot more people create or are in a great, greater creative space when it comes to their their roughest and horrible times and shit. That's like, because a lot of people ain't never had it. You see, what I'm saying a lot of people just go into it having it like that. But when you ain't had it and had it and going through ups and downs, is that's just a rough little balance. You know what I'm saying? For me, it's like I don't. It's two sides of me. You know, one. I mean, I do music for a living. I don't do nothing else but music for a living, so it's that side. But then also, it's a side to where I do music because I don't have a choice. I didn't ask for this shit. Right. He gave me this shit. You know what I'm saying? I didn't. I didn't ask for. I didn't ask this. I don't even. I feel like. I feel like. Like you know, if if God had like a little semi line, he kind of put the gift in the wrong nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to put this in this ratchet ass ghetto motherfucker right here and I'm going to leave Joe Smo up. You know what I'm saying? So for me, it's like, I can't really explain why anything is like anything. I, I just know that's what that was on my heart and that was on my spirit. And also, you know, having a good team like Punch and Il Camille with that ink pen and problem too, like they was able to really just like paint the picture. I, I, I should say add color to the sketch. Right. You, you, you feel what I'm saying? Because Lock High, like, yeah, it's Terrence Martin Lock High, but this is also the first record to where... I really took hands on by working with him and knowing I really took the Dr. Dre approach. It was like, I just focused on my strong point. My strong point is the musicality and mixing records and putting the song together. You know what I'm saying? So I went ahead and I reached out to a ninth wonder to a high tech and I did beats and it, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, yeah, no, it, it was, it's, just, it's more like, it's, Test one is a fucking name. It should be everybody's record at the end of the day. In the music seat, we gonna take around the globe. Keep it moving how we do it for show. We don't lose control. 